Over the last 150 years or so, humans have become increasingly dependent on electricity to power our lives. We've been burning fossil fuels like coal and oil to generate that electricity. But there's a limited amount of coal and oil available on Earth. Someday, they will run out. So, what will we do then? That's where renewable energy comes in. Renewable energy comes from sources that will never run out. Humans have been using renewable energy sources for hundreds of thousands of years, pretty much as long as we've been around. We've used sunlight for warmth, wind to move boats across the oceans, and flowing water to power water wheels to cut wood or mill corn. Ancient Greeks even warmed their homes with geothermal energy, heat coming from the very deepest parts of the Earth. But if we've been using renewable resources for thousands of years, why are people only starting to talk about them now? Just like fossil fuels transitioned from powering machines directly to generating electricity for machines, the same is true of renewable resources. Windmills and water wheels now power giant turbines that generate electricity. In places where there isn't enough flowing water, we've created it by building hydroelectric dams, like the Hoover Dam in the United States or the Three Gorges Dam in China. Hydroelectric dams create artificial lakes and control the flow of water to spin turbines. Tidal power uses the rising and falling of ocean tides to generate electricity. And what about our original source of renewable energy? The sun, solar panels, and concentrated solar power systems capture the sun's energy so we can store it for later use. Now, you might be wondering, if all of these resources generate usable energy and will never run out, why are we still using fossil fuels? Well, no solution is perfect. Like all energy resources, renewables have some drawbacks. Not every environment has access to renewables. For example, you can't use hydroelectric power in a desert. Another challenge is that, at the moment, fossil fuels are a major global industry. Major industries are hard to change. For example, there's a lot of infrastructure that supports fossil fuels, and modifying it or building new infrastructure for renewables is very expensive. There have been many advances in recent years building power plants that use renewable resources, but we're still not generating enough energy to meet our global need. Right now, about 10% of the world's electricity is generated from renewable resources. In the next few decades, countries around the world will be working toward figuring out the other 90. <laughs>